Frank! Oh! Damn, he did a reverse moonsault off the ground. That's how epic Ricardo Banderas is. Four hundred forty-five, definitely enough for the way. All right, so I will not be showing any more of those fights now that we've seen all the death blows. But there should be something in here. It was being guarded. Now oh, this is just a way further down. Okay. Yeah, long elevator ride through what appears to be some kind of airlock. And what do we have over here? We have ammo! Sweet! I thought that was handgun ammo. Let's go down here. This is pretty much a long, narrow hallway, but... Yeah. Some of it looks kind of like the crappy Central District in Nortoon, but... Looks like a bunch of clean freaks live here. Rather strict airlock and scanning equipment. Does not look operational, though. The inside is preserved so well. The outside probably, too. Yeah, it's pretty sta straightforward. There's only a couple places where you can actually turn any other direction than what they give you. Yeah, pretty pretty straight. Here's the first actual turn. Uh, this is actually the way down. That's an optional guy, but I'm going to take him on anyway because I want what's on the other side. And what's on the other side? We have a computer room. With the treasure chest. What's in the treasure chest? We get a sleep guard. Awesome. I don't really care except for those shell bells, but whatever. Presently, the central reactor is isolated. Isolated? Really? Well, th that means there's got to be something in there, right? Maybe a boss or... Huh. Who knows? We'll, we'll find out eventually, but they're not, they're not being very specific right now. The game tends to do that incredibly vague. believe I want to go... Yeah, definitely go left. Since there's nothing to the right. No, more airwalks. I mean, this place is very high security and has very little doors. Full of stairs and walls. What a waste. Looks like it'll keep us out. Labyrinths are not usually built to protect against enemies. They are usually made to seal up something inside of them. Sealed? If you live in prison for a long time, it'll bother you at first. But you get used to it, and ultimately come to depend on it. Whatever is shut up in here, it's going to be our enemy. The same as anyone from Solaris. That, that doesn't sound good. And here we have another computer room. We get the Black Snake, which I believe is a weapon for Bart, but since he's not here, I can't confirm that. Presently, access to all main laboratory databases is denied. I mean, they are at emergency level 5, but... Uh-oh. Now, once again, it looks like we should be able to skip this guy, but I'm telling you right now, you don't want to skip him, you want what's on the other side. So let's go ahead and take him on and try to go past him. On the other side of this guard is a save point. It's not a computer room, really. Yeah, that's that's it trying to tell me to save. I will in one second after I get this treasure chest. Penalphasol. What the hell is Penalphasol? It is. Oh wow! It's a pretty much a mega elixir. Awesome! It is an Omega Saw for everybody! I will drop a save right here. Be right back. Alright, from here, we're heady. We're ready to head. We're fixing to head down to the final level of the dungeon. You usually know that you're getting damn close to the end because there's a second save point. Let's activate. Uh, 34,999,999 hours ago. Please put commas in your large numbers. From this point, there is danger of now contamination. When entering the room, please execute a manual scan and confirm safety. To confirming, please reset the emergency level at the nearest terminal. 
Yes, yes, the manual scan. Scan complete! Confirmed! No nano contamination! You can re enter the room by resetting the emergency level at the nearest terminal, meaning we have to go back to the freaking computer room. And the last one right here doesn't count. We have to go back up to this one over here. Now we should be able to reset it. Yeah, reactor internal safety confirmed. Please reset emergency level. Reset emergency level. Presently, emergency level is normal. Sweet! So we knocked the whole emergency level down by five levels. Why they make you do this is kind of beyond me. I mean, it, it gives a realism to the whole thing. I think they're just trying to tell you, like, no, seriously, this fight's going to be tough. Decreasing pressure. This floor is completely active. Pressure decreased. Let's head over here first. And what do we have? Another computer room! No item here, but... What's on the computer? Snap. Look at all those screens. It is well hidden. In the data gaps. No. Flee? With my own will. What is this? Is this... A wild computer? Ah, oh, crap! A wild computer appeared! Throw a Pokeball at it! No. A structural record of life? No, not that. An organism? Oh. Flashback time, I assume. Looks like a troll doll. Oh, it's naked! Oh, get the pixelated porn off my screen. Very, very pixelated, actually. I don't know what that is. But apparently, Satan wants a look. What the? Okay, let's, let's get close to it. Yeah, there it is. What's with this thing? This demi humans can't even heal at that speed. This girl appears to be an artificial life form created inside the reactor. She was probably assembled in the reactor by using that series in the database and the control room. Her body is most likely constructed from autonomic machines on a molecular scale. In other words, a colony of nano machines. There's a there's a name for that in other games, but not this one. Just a colony of nano machines. I'll be taking that nano machine colony with me. Thank you. That is the existence or key factor which God will guide us by to free humanity from its yoke. What? So, if you don't mind. Bishop. Ah, Brother Billy, you're here too. This makes matters simple. I know you'll understand this narrow machine colony needs to be in the hands of an honorable person. It's destined to be the salvation of humanity. An honorable person? I certainly do not think you are honorable anymore. Eliminating the ethos in any surface dwelling humans who don't agree with your own will. What is the problem with eliminating those people not fit for salvation? Why isn't it our very faith? Isn't our very faith based on the precept that only the chosen will be saved? There's something very wrong with that. Salvation by faith is something that everyone should have an equal opportunity at attaining. Are you saying that you can save all of humankind? If Krellian uses the nano machine colony, at least we can save some chosen people. But you don't understand how to utilize this. You can't save anyone. Are you willing to take the responsibility for the loss you will cause humankind? My job now is to bring this nano machine colony back to Krellian. You see, unlike the ethos, 
Our aim is not the ancient weapons that lay in the city ruins. I don't think we conflict with your interests. Salvation or not, what are you planning on doing with this girl? I just know your deeds are not honorable. Bishop, I am sorry to say this, but I cannot be a part of what you are intent on doing. I see that you couldn't... I see that I couldn't make you understand. Then it cannot be helped. I don't have the time to convince you further. Please excuse me, as I must hurry on ahead. Wait right there! Oh, they didn't even bother giving her a robe or... Nope, just take her off naked. Doesn't count, she's now machines. H who are you? Sorry to have kept you two ladies waiting. It's time for you to do your job, elements. So, I mean, that's like seven elements that we've met now, so definitely more than the four that I had thought. <laughs> Talone, Seraphita, buy me as much time as possible. We know, we know. Stop ordering us around already. Hey, Talon, let's hurry up and get this over with so we can get out of here. I don't like dark places. Yeah, right. It's only because it is on Ramses' orders. Jeez. Now he's got us protecting this garbage. Well, that's how it is, folks. It'll help us if you hurry up and lose. Who in heavens are you? We don't have time to waste talking to you. Well, excuse us, but we can't let you go just yet. We really don't care much for Grellion, but if we do a crappy job, it'll make Ramses look bad. But thanks to you fools reviving her, we can get this mission over with sooner than we thought. Yeah, we didn't know how to operate that machinery, so we were so confused. Thank you very much for your kind help. Oh, Sarah, don't tell him that. Just as I was building up things to make us sound psych ecologically superior to them. Damn. What? But when people do you a kindness, you should always say thank you. That's what Grandma always said. But I'm impressed alone. Psychologically superior? Your gin and tonic futon brain cyborg implants sure make you sound smart. That's positronic photon brain, you idiot. Gin and tonic futon? Make me sound like I'm a sleepy drunk. It's already bad enough as it is, Positronic Photon Brain Cyborg. It's bound to get us in trouble with the makers of Star Trek. Nobody knows what, what they're going for there. Definitely not a case I'm at the end. Do you guys just have too much free time on your hands? Uh-oh. Sorry. Sorry. Be careful, the elements may look harmless, but underestimate them and it'll cost you dearly. That's it. Talon, do we want to be called harmless? I guess the answer is no, because now it's boss time. Against Talone and Seraphita. First things first, I'm casting a Ranky. Because they tend to do this. And it almost killed pretty much two of my party members, so I'm gonna go ahead and speed up Satan because a hasted Satan is my best friend. Now he can go ahead and cast Sazanami on everybody because we prepped that Ranky beforehand, and we should be good to go. 